uh, Sogakope, where uh, you would be aware that there have been a development with the murder of uh, 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 an, an assembly man for Sogakope South who was killed in his home. We are quickly getting onto the telephone lines to get an update from our reporter Robert Abilba, who has been monitoring the situation, and he has some update for us. Uh, so, Robert, uh, what can you report? He has some update for us. Robert, can you hear me? I want you to tell us uh, what's the latest on this uh, uh, murder situation in Sugakopa. Uh, the, uh, as of now, the town is receiving the needed calmness that one should think of. Business is going on unabated mm. without anything happening. Just as it happened yesterday, it's not like that today. Uh, the, the, the lower the, the lower Volta Bridge that was congested yesterday is free. Cars are moving and people are going about their business. But the youth, with support from the opinion leaders at the press conference, has given a three-day ultimatum to the police to ensure that they get them the perpetrators or they will get... They will meet, uh, incur the wrath of the youth again. It will even be more. Right. Than so, what they so, so, Robert, Robert, I need to get a fair understanding of what exactly is agitating the residents over this murder. Because, I mean, the police, according to what the reports we gathered, uh, didn't have enough resources to respond in good time to to this. And they have explained they've taken the necessary uh, steps in order to start investigations. Is it not enough to reassure? Sure, the residents that the police is on top of this. It is not enough because it is not the first of its kind. It is not the first time that some such thing has happened. It happened to more than one or two within the same enclave, the same area. Mm. An MTN operator was once met the same thing and was named. They shot his legs and said he's lucky. They don't want to kill him. They don't want to only teach him a lesson and left. The police never did anything. Uh, the same thing, Roberts entered one room and shot and killed a woman and a husband. They didn't do anything. And this time around, it is alleged that even the disease, two hours after he had conversation with the divisional police commander, after which he came and that thing was happening, you know, the armed robbers struggled about two hours to even break through to enter the room. By then, this man knew he was in danger, he was calling, they were not answering. So what are you telling me that they haven't resources? Since then, they have still not gotten resources. Mm. Yet, oh, we saw cars there, we saw uh, uh, a policemen wielding guns. Where were those guns? Right. That's why they are angry with the peace. Right. So, 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 Robert, Robert, I know, I know. Earlier I, in the morning, earlier in the morning, I spoke with uh, the public relations uh, commander of the district police, uh, Corporal Prince Dogbache, and he uh, actually raised concerns about the timing, uh, reference to how long uh, the robbers were at the gate and knocking it down. I mean. Uh, so, right now, the police says it is investigating, and shouldn't the residents be assured that, uh, that something is being done? Right, uh, so we lost Robert Abeoba, but uh, one eyewitness has been giving us an account of exactly what happened. Let's listen. The police, we have realized, are more active in arresting drivers and some selected Okada riders in town for petty cash rather than responding to our emergency calls and to saving our lives. We have come to realize that their inaction has become so loud that it cannot go unmentioned. Their response time to emergency calls has been very, 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 very poor, to say the least. We are not pleased at all. In all circumstances, you will call a place that it could take them two minutes or five minutes to get to, it will take an hour. And usually it is when the armed robbers are bolting that they come shooting uselessly in the air. 